Hey YouTube, so um, I thought I'd make a quick video. I'm on my webcam, so excuse the quality and excuse my hair. It's just in a natural mess, and I got this like little band on my head or whatever. But I thought I'd make a quick video um to like show my face. Um, try to scoot up so um y'all can hear me to show my face. So um, cause I've been gone for quite a while. I just do a few quick updates. But I know y'all tired of updates, like, y'all, like, darn girl, when you gonna film some videos? I have a few videos on my camera that I need to edit and upload. I did a sister tag. I did my baby sister's nails for her graduation. And I filmed that kind of sort of. I don't know how the angle looks because, um, I got a tripod and I couldn't see behind my camera. So I just set it up and hopefully it looked like I wanted to look or at least look halfway decent. So I'm gonna try to edit that and upload that. But um, y'all, even though I don't have a job right now, I have been like extremely busy, and I've been busy with like filling out job applications. Like, yeah, I probably filled out a total of 30 applications, and I'm just waiting for people to call me back. I did get an email about the juvenile probation officer position, but they said in 30 days if I didn't get a phone call, then I mean they gave the job to someone else. And I think it'll be 30 days tomorrow, and I haven't heard from them, so. Um, like I said, I've been filling out applications. I'm on LinkedIn, I'm on Monster, I'm on Career Builder, I'm on Indeed. Like, I'm about on everything that you can be on. Um, mostly I have been filling out in Georgia, because that's where my baby lives. And, um, <sighs> I'm supposed to be moving to Thomasville, um, Probably within two months at the longest. But me and Bay are going to go ahead and officially get married. Yes, officially married. For those who are close to me and people that I talk to know that um, I'm getting married. Yeah, I was supposed to be married before the new year, like before 2014. But things kept coming up and, you know, we just didn't do it. But we're going to go ahead and do that now. And, um, it's not going to be a big wedding. I'm going to the courthouse, for one. Everybody know I'm cheap. I never dreamed of having a big wedding. When I was little, I didn't plan my weddings. Um, I planned how I wanted my house to look. Like, I drew up rooms and decorated the rooms, the color of the walls. Like, planning a house was my thing when I was little. It wasn't having a wedding. And I just feel like people have weddings to put on for, like, family and friends. But those family and friends ain't paying no bills. Like, people go broke. I know people who are still paying for their wedding. And they got married, like, five to ten years ago. So, I'm not doing all of that for people. Like, I really don't care. I just want it to be something small. His parents could come if they want to. My parents could come if they want to. I don't care if nobody comes. As long as it's me and Bay and the person who's going to marry us and my witness to sign my wedding certificate, license, whatever. Then... That's all I need, like, for real, for real. Um, as far as kids, no, we have not planned to have any children no time soon. Um, I at least want to have, like, $10,000 saved up before I have a child. Um, I just one of those people who be overly prepared and unprepared because, um, bills real and Sally made first payment is due the first week of December, first or second week of December. And she already emailed me twice. So, um, yeah, I can't afford a child right now. Um, but me and Bay do have a baby. Um, his name is Simba Charlie Biscuit. He has three names, and I can tell you why. One, I named him Simba because he was standing on top of, um, my mom's little outdoor table. And he was looking over the yard, like, kind of how Simba looked over Pride Rock. So, that's, I named him Simba, my baby sister, and, um... My father-in-law said, name him Charlie. So, my mom said she wanted to name him Biscuit, and she said she still was going to call him Biscuit. So, my cat's name is Simba Charlie Biscuit. I have pictures of him on Instagram. I'm trying to post too many because I know a lot of people didn't follow me on Instagram to look at a damn cat. So, yeah, that's that. Um, What else? Oh, I just knew I was about to go shopping. Until I called Georgia today to find out how much my speeding ticket was that I got yesterday. <sighs> like, they got me. 
and that ticket was like $193, and I was so pissed, so there goes my birthday shoes and stuff, which I'm really sad about, but my mom said go to court to try to fight it, but I'm not driving three hours just to go back to court, because by the time I pay for gas, even if they drop my ticket down to half, because I know they're not going to dismiss it, even though that's my first ever offense. Like, y'all, like, for real, for real, I ain't never been rolled up in school. I never been kicked out of school. I never got a pink slip. I never been written up on a job. I never gotten in trouble. And now I got a speeding ticket. Like, she said they made it out because of my first offense. But, um, yeah, anywho, I'm just gonna, I'm not the type of person to kiss no butt for nothing. And I really just don't feel like driving. Down there for three hours, and they and the ticket see maybe the same price. Down there, wasting money on gas and time driving to sell up country ass town. So, you know, but um, this weekend I went to Thomasville and I stayed with Bay. And my weekend was cut short thanks to my mom wanting me to babysit and stuff, so that really sucked. But anyway, I spent time with Bay and his family, and I loved it. Simba loved it. I took him with me, and he. Y'all, he my baby caught a frog, and he ate it. I was so happy because I just thought my cat was a punk cat, and he wasn't really no real cat because he wasn't doing cat stuff. But, um, yeah, oh, he's seven. He'll be eight weeks Thursday. Um, what else? Um, I've been makeup shopping on, um, IK House. I'm still deciding if I'm going to order. Um, I also looked at Max, um, Pure Heron, or Heron 2, whatever y'all want to call it. It's supposed to be coming out. Lord's lipstick, but y'all, that look like brazenberry. It looks like violet voltage, and that other, it looked like those two limited edition purple lipsticks from Maybelline that I hated because the quality just sucked. And I'm like, I'm not paying Max sixteen dollars for lipstick I already got. And then on Tim Talia's lips, Tim Talia, whatever, that shit was so streaky. It was uneven. And I'm like, I already own this, and the ones I own are streaky. So why waste sixteen dollars now? I hate to not get it, and it came out, and it looks perfect. Then I'm going to be pissed, but I missed out on the Osborne today due to my check being late. But when I seen the lipstick, it looked like Viva Glam Nikki too. to be perfectly honest. So those lipsticks I could dupe, so I'm not even worried about that. But if I make a purchase from IK House, then um, I'll do a haul. I also got a big bag of stuff that I need to haul, so I'll probably pull that out tomorrow i ain't gonna say a big bag i'm lying it's in a big bag but it ain't a lot of stuff it's stuff that i haul like when i went shopping before graduation i'm not really gonna say shop because i ain't buy a lot of stuff but um i'm gonna try to haul all of those items i miss you guys like i really really have missed you guys i've been in like a funk because i'm getting kind of depressed because i haven't found a job yet and um i got my master's and i have to pay for it and I haven't got no job, so how do you expect me? Like, I just feel like I paid so much money for my education, and it's not doing anything for me. Granted, I know I was not guaranteed a job, but still, y'all, like, nobody calls me back. And then somebody told me I was overqualified, and I didn't even meet all the qualifications. And then somebody else told me I was too young. Like, what the f does that have to do with anything? Like, nobody is really giving me a chance. Like, I'm either too green, which is too new. Or too young, you know, for the field. I don't think I have enough experience. I haven't done enough stuff, but I'm qualified. Like, I have my master's. I didn't do internships. I didn't have other jobs. I didn't, I have a lot of volunteer experience in the field of social work. I have a lot of certifications for social work, but these older people don't want to give up their job. They don't want to give me a chance. Like, and it's really starting to irritate me. Like, I'm really just going to move and work at like JCPenney or walmart or something until because i'm not the type of person who can sit around they like i know god probably gave me this time to relax because i've been going hard since i was like 17 like working 40 plus hours a week and i was in high school and um going to college like doing work and going right after undergrad having three days off going right to the master's program like I have been working myself in the ground but I feel like that's all I know how to do like I just I don't know how to relax anymore so I'll just sitting around not doing nothing is really killing me like it's bothering me so yeah and 
Also, shout out to Rootness for inspiring this video because we was texting while I was at my sister Boren's graduation today. And um, she was like, she need to be filming because she ain't did a video in a while. And I hadn't either. So she did an update, which I'm about to watch. And I figured I'd do an update. Speaking of videos, I have like 53 videos in my feed. Well, my watch list that I need to be watching. So I'm trying to catch up on those tonight and tomorrow. So, yeah. And I'm trying to remember to pause the video before it ends. So I can leave a comment because my watch later is on a loop. So it plays the next video comes over ends. I know I could take the loop off, but I just prefer it because it keeps me from clicking. And I can lift my bed and stay comfortable. And Simba is scratching at my front door, so he probably want to come curl up with me before he goes to sleep. But, um, yeah, you guys, that's about it. I miss y'all, like, for real. And those of you who, um comment with me on Instagram and those of you who comment with me on YouTube I really appreciate that because y'all ain't really I really ain't got no life like for real for real <laughs> like I enjoy talking to y'all and a few of y'all have my personal cell phone number who I text back and forth with and care like we text if not every day it's like every other day. I think the longest we went maybe like four days and I kept saying, text her, text her, text her. And I even put a time uh, alert on my phone. And right when it went off, she had texted me. And I was like, look at God. Because I was just about to text her. But um, my computer is done for the third time today. See, like, yeah, i really been on my computer working. But, um, oh, and speaking of videos, none of y'all left suggestions or comments on what y'all wanted to see on the last video. So, I guess y'all don't want to see my videos anymore? Is that what y'all telling me? Is that what you're telling me? <laughs> so, yeah. So, leave me some comments and some, and some suggestions because um I don't want to keep doing the same thing. And somebody inboxed me saying, told me to stop doing Dollar Tree hauls. I should be shopping somewhere else. But um the way my debit card is set up and the way my bank account is set up and the way my bills are set up. Um, I shop where I can afford and I shop where I want to, even though the Dollar Tree is not, is, is not the only place I can afford, but why pay more when I could get it for a dollar? So, anywho, you guys, um, I'm about to try to comb my hair out so I don't wake up in knots. But, um, yeah, this video is too fucking long and I've been talking entirely too much. And I know y'all probably didn't clicked off this video. So, um, like I said, excuse the quality of my webcam. This is supposed to be something quick, but apparently I'm at 13 minutes. So, anywho, you guys, um, I will catch you in the next video. And I will holler at you later. Bye-bye.